You have any idea at all how long it took for me to learn to solve that the very first time? I spent weeks upon weeks upon weeks studying algorithms, studying patterns, pattern recognition, applying algorithms to finally get to a point where I could solve that. There was just something inside me that said, you know what, I want to, I want to learn how to do that. And because of that, I did it. And I apply a lot of that back to real estate and as a business owner myself, you know, going into a lot of things as a new owner, as an entrepreneur, you're not going to know the answers as to what's going on out there. And a man that's far smarter than I'll ever be once said, you know what, you want to become successful, double your rate of failure, double your rate of failure. And we are taught in school a lot, and I don't necessarily agree with this at all, that failing is a bad thing. There is no such thing as failure in the business world. You either, you either succeed or you learn a lesson. There is no such thing as failure. Every time that you have pushed forward and you've hit a roadblock that has stopped you, that roadblock is nothing other than a lesson of what not to do in the future. If you're out there continuously seeking out more knowledge with the caveat that you're not doing anything with it because you're thinking that you're going to find a magic, a magic something that's going to take you to where you want to go. That's never going to happen. What's going to, the only thing that's going to take you where you want to go is this right here. You need to start walking. You need to start doing what you're learning. You need to figure something out and not even figure it out. You need to just kind of get an idea in the back of your head of what you need to do and start doing it. The answers will come as you're walking. There's nothing that's going to ever happen just by, just by sitting there reading a book. You need to to take action, massive action. Don't be scared of failure. Don't be scared of what might happen if this goes wrong. You know, I saw somebody, I saw a signature on somebody's email the other day that said, I'll, I'll believe in, I'll believe uh, the strength of your plan whenever I see your backup plan. Basically saying, you know, if you're really motivated to get your first plan done, your backup plan ain't gonna be that important, you know? If you really want to make this a business, if you really want to change your life, if you want to turn yourself into a multimillionaire in a short period of time, what you need to do is take action, regardless of what the consequences might be. Ignore them. Just move forward, take massive action, and double your rate of failure.